So today we're going to talk about something called uncertainty, and I'll be explaining it visually. Our uh, uncertainty. Uh, but you need to see the thing about uncertainty is uh, if you don't understand it well first time now, it becomes a pain. Study. So I have one request for you guys, and that is Akun jo bujha bo. And make sure you pay as much attention as possible. Okay. So, I want to use Corona. I'll be just doing it with uh, more net and so that using materials. So, I can't get this instead of just a dot. The concept first, let's talk about the ultimate idea, the essence of what uncertainty is meant to be. So, uncertainty hooks whenever you take any reading, take a set. Say, for example, I mean, you're going to have this string, take a set. So a string ticket. I'm just going to add two string tickets. So I'm going to a string a length term up to check. So a pashe I'm going to just drag from six. It doesn't really matter where I put it, uh, as long as it's not zero. That's the proper standard method. So eta I'm going to do it's exactly at six centimeters. A jagat. And this end is at you could say. Um, If you take a really good look, you can. If you take a really good look, a jagat. What do you think is the reading? Let it focus. What do you think is the reading here? Twenty-two point seven. Okay, so we can say twenty-two point seven. Any other answer? Twenty-two point nine. So yeah, twenty-two point seven, twenty-two. Nine. I would say twenty-two point six. So basically, we'll have different opinions, right? So twenty-two point nine to hold the back. Twenty-two point nine to hold the back to argue about the trick back here. But twenty-two point seven, twenty-two point six. Yeah, I mean, pretty much both of them would be considered to be correct. So this is this is the main thing that uh, we really need to figure out. When we study uh, these sort of things, the only six centimeter lekle that's not good enough. So, our data reads to the closest 0.1 centimeter a scale. So, even if it's exactly at six, you should be writing 6.0 centimeters. So, we're going to count it. So, we might be like, okay, fine, maybe 6.1 centimeter might be a correct answer. Let's write. So, the best way of writing this would actually be that there's no exact value. You should be writing something like 6.0 plus minus 0.1 centimeters. 0.1 centimeters. That's actually the better way of writing this because if on any argument that you are going to agree, we'll never end, and we can't all agree that this is exactly at six centimeters, right? And this is true for any reading actually. You mean, Jotoi Milan or Keno? Can you say it's exactly at 6.0000 centimeters? No, you can't. It's practically impossible. So it is solution taking. Solution like this is you give a range, the a range, the little a that. So that's the first concept that we need to touch today. The how the answer in page page is that, and we have some very interesting stuff we're going to try at the to explain answer today. Very interesting things. Okay, so the thing is that we just see them. Okay, so Akon, I will amra ja ja bolla. This is just introducing the idea. The Jokoni act of value bolla hai. It's not possible. It's practically impossible to say that value is exact. Amar they're all readings throughout everything that we do. The entire universe of readings and physics and whatnot. All of this is actually something that is based on estimations. So when we say estimations, we kind of what we mean is that the values are something that are here, um, at a range of one to one. So Akon, uh, basically what we have today is an explanation for it. We've got some simple arts and crafts machine. I've got some paper which are different colors. So we'll be doing some different stuff with them. And um, I'm not much worried. So, like, you know, how to actually explain the concept of uncertainty? We can take one paper, and um, we're gonna we're gonna mark out, say, like, you know, a can they get? This paper is 21 centimeters long. So, 15 centimeter point at the back. So, 
15th century is exactly the 15th century যেটা কিন্তু there is no way of exactly saying it. so একটু কম বেশি হয় পারে যেটা আমরা বললাম যে 15.1 থেকে 14.9 so just to make it visually more uh, clear আমরা যেটা করব যে আমরা 14 থেকে 16 পর্যন্ত ওর রেঞ্জটা রাখছি ঠিক আছে Here we have a strip of paper. A strip of paper at the Rami Keter for it. So if I was to write the the length on this paper, I'm going to keep it out. 16th centimeter. What is that? 16 uh, plus minus 0.1. Approximately. It would be 15. I can write it. 15 plus minus one. Yes, sir. I've written it here. So, Akon, basically, I made a strip of paper which has a length of about 15 centimeters. So, it is this is 16. Ek do matha. It is 14. Mask me 15. Okay. So, this is our first strip. Okay. Stricter as well. Now, <clears throat> let's just go ahead and get another color, and let's make another strip. A bar, a strip ta, act to differently curve in the sense that it is chilo 15 centimeters. Let's say I have number three, 10 centimeters. So 10 centimeters cut to leki cut to be. Abar, um, I'm going to 10 acta dark dilam, 9 acta dark dilam, and 11. So ten plus minus one. Akon, yes. we have these two strips. One is fifteen centimeters plus minus one. Another one is ten centimeters plus minus one. If I put them end to end, it is ideal. Kotho tuku length wa uchit from one side to the other. Twenty-five centimeters. Kotho uchit twenty-five centimeters. Correct. So yeah, it of what out it 25 centimeters. In the Kali 25, will it be correct? No, 25 plus minus one. Minus one. So what's the longest that these two papers can be? 15 plus minus one and 10 plus minus one. 25 plus one. 27. Actually, gonna be 27. That's the longest they can be. Yes, this, sir. My very maximum limit is gonna be 27. Okay. 16. Eleven or sixteen mila, we are going to get twenty-seven. That's the longest this page, these two pieces together. And what's the shortest they can? I mean, they can just to make life easier. Eight. Twenty-three. Yep. So it's a twenty-three. They get a full column. They take it. They can a full column. This is the shortest that they can be, but within our measured range. So the one eight at the shortest range. So today I'm not worried. Twenty-three. So when we put these two pasha pashi, what we should be writing is actually what should be twenty-five. Yes, that's the middle range. Plus minus two. Keno? Karon again. Again, our other twenty-five will be kofon. When it exactly it is the ten high, or it exactly to be fifty. So ten or fifteen to the pasha pashi high. The later. I mean, basically, what we're saying is the values are ten minus ten plus minus one and fifteen plus minus one. So the longest width, I mean, normal range twenty five. The longest it can be, the extra matter that we have not written here. The longest this strip of paper together can be is actually seventeen centimeters, right? Tw sorry, twenty seven centimeters. And at the shortest it can be possibly within this range. So this is we take it that we have not passed for it. After extra matter, I have written here. So one year the shortest this can be is what nine and I think they get fourteen. So 23 centimeters. So basically, what we have is two measurements. Okay, sir. I'm not just very simply put. Two measurements. Is it two measurement now? Sir, two measurements are not accurate because it's practically impossible to have exact values. <clears throat> so the measurements we took was 15 plus minus one. Making it a double x. 15 plus minus one. 
and we took another reading which is 10 plus minus 1 so amader ei dui ta readings right so ei dui reading er jeta amra kortechi is dui ta ke amra so this can be a descriptor it can be it's actually like this somewhere here mane it's anywhere between 9 theke 11 similarly a strip length is anywhere between 14 to 16 we don't know exactly length to go and this is how we represent it je ei jagar modhe somewhere ekhon if we were to take these two strips ekta por ekta rakhi so what's the total length of these two strips so because we don't know each one of them exactly tale amader jeta korte hobe je oi range to constitute 10 plus minus 1 15 plus minus 1 amra pasapashi rakhlam dekhlam the longest it can be is 16 and 11 So it's actually 27, the longest value it can be. Our it is a jokhon amna short kori, ekdom short kore pin jokhon. If it was that short, then it becomes 9 and 14. So 9 and 14 hoyle, tokhon ke the shortest is 23. So how do you write this nicely? The only way you write this nicely is if you write 25 equal to 25. Good job, good job. 25 plus minus. Right. So, a kind of way we can say that uncertainty exists when you add or subtract values. You always add their absolute uncertainties. When you do a one plus a one, we do one at one. So, you always add their absolute uncertainties. Now, I mean, I like to complicate it. Okay, so we make it a little more tricky. Say I put this strip on top of this. Strip. So it would make it would like cut values from both the strips. So what mathematical function am I showing here? If I say actor strip or matter actor delay it's addition. Actor upre actor reke it a different subtraction. Subtraction, right? Oh, so subtraction, sir. Akon, age a gap ta. How big can this gap be? How small can this gap be? The smallest we can show this gap is eta to the very long by the purple one. Aaj the green to very short. So your gap is this much, which is how much? Eleven or fourteen? So that's three, right? So that's three, right? Eleven, fourteen uh, minus eleven. That's three. If we actually measure it, and we ten up to see. So 11 and 14. If you step back, you'll get basically three centimeters. That's the shortest. So yeah, that's the shortest the difference can be. Three. Okay, I'm gonna simple babu shuru kore. So these are both like 10 and 15. Actor per actor, I subtract kore. You're supposed to get five. But I get five. No. Because you're only going to get it when it's going to be 15 minus 10. It again to me to the shortened part. If this becomes the shortest possible amount, which is 13, sorry, 13 or 14, and it again to the longest part for the minus 11. Now the shortest area you can get between two is three. Yes, sir. And what can be the longest between the two? Eight again to the short curve, hello. Eight again to the long curve. That's the longest gap you can get. So that's going to be eight the longest, which is sixteen minus eight the shortest, which is nine. Thank you. So how do you write this mathematically? First, it's going to be fifteen. Uh, five plus minus uh, two centimeter. In minus ten is five plus minus. Plus minus mm. two centimeter. The important lesson that I'm trying to teach here is that during addition or subtraction, it doesn't really matter. The value will always be added. The uncertainty is always added. It's like it's a little bit like Chinese whisper. So why can Chinese whisper tell so? ट्रीस 
No. So very important actor Jini Shwetha said, uncertainty is never lost or subtracted. It is always added. So we have two things here. Kiki, addition and subtraction. When you add values, basically, it is not a script of the script. When you add values, uncertainty is directly added. When you subtract values, the time is not to the hell, uncertainty is also added. Uh, let's go back to something a little easier now. I guess it's a complex, 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 let me just go for all these parts. Okay, now I want you guys to try something. Shall I chat a little bit? How many marbles are there? And you can do something. You can use your plus minus trick. You can use your plus minus trick. You can use your plus plus minus trick. I don't want you guys to count it. Yes, sir. Don't worry about this. Don't worry about this. So, Akon, let's see. What do we have in the answers? We have quite a few answers. Very interesting ones. We've got, achha, wow, we've got a huge range. 20, 25 plus minus 3, 20 plus minus 3, 35 plus minus 5, 25 4 plus minus 3, 20 plus minus 5, 25 plus minus 5, 40 plus minus 5, 30 plus minus 3, 21 plus minus 4, 25 plus minus 3, 30 plus minus 5. I'll say 25 plus minus 5. Also. I mean, though, I really don't know. I mean, actually, done. So, moment of truth. Ready? Yes, yes sir. sir. Yes, sir. Seven. Oh no, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, oh my god, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, okay, so it's 34. <laughs> So yeah, I think the closest answer would be 34 in Asha Pasha Jara's answer. Kashaf gave 30 plus minus 5, it's in his range. Fabia, oh, 28 plus minus 5, just missed it. Just outside the new range. Zuhair, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sajid, 30 plus minus 30. <laughs> I am the one! Uh, yeah. Now we're doing 34 marbles here, which is within this little place. Is it calculus or how it's useful to say the plus minus a bepata came up with a kaza laka? Right? So, again, interesting actor genius. Um, how how much would be considered fair? It's a plus minus of kotuku uchi tar kotuku uchi na. For example, I have a few marbles in my hand. I have a few marbles in my hand. How many marbles do you think I have in my hand now? That's it. So I get an interesting Jinish quote this. So I calculate what you guys done what are doing now is when we had 34 marbles, most of you guys wrote plus minus five. How the plus minus five feel like this? I want to show I like this so at any value, like you know, four, five, six, that I have the long six, plus minus two. A value to come up the estimation error to come out. Are you saying this? It's a very smart thing your brain does. So yeah, let's see how many marbles I actually have. I have one. Six marbles in my hand. So, a lot of you, I guess you kind of got it. So Akon, if we do some quick maths. Huh? 35 plus 34 plus minus five. How much is this? What the percent is this of this? Basically what I'm asking is, what is your uncertainty in percentage? 14.7. 14.7. So 15%. So this is your percentage uncertainty. What's your uncertainty here? So 33%. It's 33%. It's a lot of answer. So calculate. I mean, you have a range on equitables, but the percentage uncertainty is large. Again, range to comparatively it seems big. So, so which one was a better guess? Considering uncertainty, how would you consider a guess to be better? Sir, the one with the less percentage error. 
that's certainly one way of going right i would go with that just get the percentage uncertainty call i would say that's a better guess the main thing i'm trying to explain here the essence of what i'm teaching is there is a thing called percentage uncertainty and we can use it just the way we just used it percentage uncertainty has its uses percentage na dile 10 plus minus 1 eta ke bola hoy absolute just the solid say centimeters eta absolute answer ar eta ke tumi jodi 1 divided by 10 into 100% pabo we call this percentage answer so yeah. Absolutely, sir. So we understood the concept of absolute uncertainty. We understood the concept of percentage uncertainty. We understood the concept of the existence of uncertainty, and how you have to deal with it when you're doing different calculations. Okay, then. Bye, bye. Thank you. I love you, sir.